What's good, y'all? Back again with another May Night post match reaction. Uh, yeah, it's a different setting. I'm at my roommates. They're graduating today, so I'm at a graduation. So, I want to give y'all my post match reaction thoughts to the man you. Um, West Ham game, yeah, West Ham game. Uh, first half was utter shit. Uh, too many times I've said that this year. It's too many times we have seen them just, just play bad, not good. Um, like they had a chance to score. Like Bowen, like Bowen for them, he just kept skimming. Alex Tell was even once he got past, he just absolutely just did him in. And the Red good, good, good thing they didn't score. He could have at least two or three goals in the first half, just how bad he was. He wasn't really creating, creating anything. Um, this wasn't that good, you know. As you know, the first goal was zone marking. How many times have we said to, to stop zone marking? Zone marking is just completely awful. I don't get it. Like, I don't get why why they just continue to do this. This zone marking crap. Just man up, man up, and marking man for the corner. But it's, West Ham scored off that because my mark the uh, goal score. I think it was Susick. And that was that was first half. It was just just crap. They didn't do anything. I don't think we we really even like create anything. So second half brings uh, all we brings on. Rashford and Bruno. I don't know why. Van der Beek, you could have taken out Martial, who got hurt anyway, so he had taken out. You could have taken out Paul, but you could have taken out Scott McTominay, who I've said countless times. I don't know what his best attribute is. But um, he he took off. Shit, who did he take off? Well, he took off Cavani and Van der Beek. Van der Beek, unlucky. Hopefully, he does start Tuesday against Leipzig. And Cavani, they said, I think Cavani got injured, so. That sucks, but and Bruno changed again. I think Bruno created like eight chances in the second half, which is utterly ridiculous. Um, his importance to the team, you know, it's shown again, man. It's just shown again how important he is to us. You can't rest him because we probably have you know performance like we did in the first half. But every time he comes in, he makes an impact. He makes a subtle, big impact. So we have to see that. Rashford, Rashford goal. Rashford scored. Of course, you know what? Shit, fast break. Good goal. Bruno would pass. Greenwood would have finished uh, for a second goal. And then for the and then for a score, first goal, Paul Pogba, man. Oh, my gosh. If he can show this quality just consistently, man. We're not trying to see no, no, you know, fake Paul Pogba. Like, this is what Pogba can do every time. Okay, Paul Paul, but yeah, you, you, what a shot, outside the box, curler, absolutely phenomenal, great goal, needed it, he needed it, and yeah, winning the game 3-1, um, also, just a great, uh, my, my pen always still hasn't changed, I still feel like I don't know if he's it, but he wins, man, he wins when needed to do, um, then we got Leipzig this Tuesday. That's going to be make or break, man. If they don't win that, best believe. If, if, if they don't advance in Champions League, it's best believe, man. It's not good. Not good at all. But they got the job done. They won. <laughs> Can't really say too much. But, yeah, man. You guys don't forget to like and sub. Y'all comment down below. You guys thoughts, reaction to the game. And also, uh, I'm into a released that Michael Jordan Wizards video. Uh it's already done. I did done everything. So I I I gotta just upload it basically. So that'll be tomorrow, likely. I'll upload it. And yeah man. See you guys later.